I want to ask you today, is it true that becoming more valuable will attract best opportunity at work and business to you? So why did God say that to his prophet to choose the best singer? Can I say that means God was saying that his prophet to choose the most valuable people. Keep watching and let's dive into how to become more valuable in order to attract the best opportunities in life. That come today, that come today. Hello everyone, my name is Afolake Janet Oyelami. Please, if this channel is impacting you in one way or the other, subscribe to our channel, like my video and share with others to impact them also. How can you become valuable in order to be the best at work, in order to be the best business owner, in order to attract more customers if you have your own business? But before I go deep into this topic, let me give the keyword that summarizes today's topic. The keyword today says, if your prayer is for your business competitors, or co-worker life to be destroyed so that your life will be better that prayer is a demonic one look at the birds they fly in the sky and none of them fight against each other because the sky is so big to contain all of them hear this truth the world is so big for individuals to showcase their gift to glorify god and become successful so don't say another person's business should be destroyed so that you take their customers don't say your co-worker should be demoted so that you get promoted be good to all if you want success when jehoshaphat was going to fight the enemy he chose people that could sing and praise God and when they started to sing when they started to display their excellence in singing and worshiping God God through that dealt with their enemy but that worship alone their enemies perished David became more valuable he trained himself in private and when it is time for God to prove himself through him God showcase his power by allowing him to kill Goliath just because he became more valuable you might be asking in your mind what exactly is this meaning of becoming more valuable to become more valuable means you increase in knowledge and experiences that give you the wisdom to contribute in a meaningful way to a business, a project, a partnership, etc. You become more valuable as you gain insight that lets you, in the case of a business, increase the revenues, decrease the cost, open up new market opportunities, lend efficiencies to the business that they couldn't have gotten without your participation. You increase in value as you learn more as you make mistakes elsewhere that your new business doesn't have to pay for you become more valuable as you build up skills and relationships that you are able to leverage in future opportunities now let me go straight to the point how then can you become more valuable to attract the best opportunities in life number one train yourself privately like i read in the bible about the story of david david has started to train himself privately he killed lion he killed bear he has been training himself privately he added more value to his life and that was why he had the confidence to go and face goliath and killed him becoming more valuable will increase your confidence to face what other people think they can never face and we notice that because david had become more valuable 
when he killed Goliath, that was what gave him the opportunity to start to live in Saul's house. And that was what gave him the opportunity to be the leader of soldiers that go to war, that go for war, that go to war to kill the enemies. And that was what brought David opportunity to become the king of Israel in those days. So, train yourself privately. If you need to read book, read. If you need to listen to encouraging video on YouTube, listen to it to train yourself. When you train yourself in a private, become more valuable in the public, you become more attractive to opportunities. Number two, add more immunity to your life when opportunity starts to come. Maybe you have passed through a lot of problems in life and when you finally got a good job and you finally start a business and you started to receive little money here and there and you start to show off that you have arrived. That will never attract more opportunities to you. It is good to drive big cars. It is good to wear beautiful clothes and look good when you when you have the money. I had a quote that says, the rich are loud, the wealthy are quiet. When you get to that top you are looking for, had humility to your life. When you had this humility to your life, that is what will attract more opportunity for you. Number three, write down your desire down exactly the way you imagine it in your heart. Maybe you want to be the CEO of your company and you are thinking in your heart that it can never be possible because you are the only colored person in that company. For this reason, you back down, you give up. Or maybe you are the oldest in that company and you wanted to apply for a CEO job and you said, Maybe people will say, I'm too old, so you refuse to go for it. Maybe you are the youngest in that company and you say, I can't apply for that CEO because they will never give you because you believe you are the youngest. When you write down exactly what you desire in your heart, you have taken the first step that creates opportunities for you. Then take the next step by adding pictures of what exactly you want beside that dream you write down. Then continue to confess and look at your dream with gratitude that it will come to pass. You may not believe me because most of my video I always mention this particular thing, particular attitude, particular action by writing down what you imagine and confessing on it. Speaking to material things does work it has worked for me it has worked for most successful people that's why i keep on saying this look for that write it down confess on it naturally the way god created the world is whatever you think in your heart the universe bring it to you if your energy your thought is so desperate to have that thing and you know it is good and it will glorify God. The universe, the angels will be bringing that to you, closer to you gradually. And if you now had gratitude and persistence and perseverance to what you are asking for, it will suddenly happen in your life. So what exactly am I saying? When you do these three, one, Train yourself privately, be humble, write down exactly what you imagine on the paper or in your dream book. When you do all this, you are adding more value to yourself. And the more you add more value to yourself, the more you become confident, the more your self-esteem increases, the more people will notice it, the more it attracts opportunities to you. Hope this encourage you. Hope this impacts you to run after your dreams. Speak to you soon. God bless.